We love avocados. Yes, but we do. when it comes to guacamole, could you be getting duped? Yeah. There are several reports of restaurants replacing avocados in their guac for cheaper alternatives. Why? Uh, you may know this. Avocado prices have doubled since July wow. 2018. Highest price they've been in more than a decade. I told you we should have bought that avocado ranch. We talked <laughs> about it. We've we been joked. talking about that for 12 few, seasons. A few years ago, we were like, let's just retire and move to an avocado Should ranch we let, and grow avocados. Dr. Botch, yeah. are you in? I'm in, I, I, anytime. Okay. That ship has sailed, Drew. But, but I do find this interesting for a multitude of reasons because if you have a food allergy and you think you're getting guacamole with avocados and you aren't, that's a problem. What we have here, these are three guacamoles that have alternatives in place of the avocado. And we are going to try to guess the secret ingredient we do not know. So we thought we would put this to the test. Let's start with A. Travis, so we're talking macamole. 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 Okay. Let's see. A. So I have to say, if I ate that at a restaurant, I would pretty confidently know yeah. it wasn't guacamole. <laughs> it does More taste More like a different. hummus almost. Yeah. Um, tahini? It's a vegetable. I Is would it? feel like broccoli. I want to say it's broccoli. I agree. It, it has that sort of I think consistency, it's broccoli. you think? Is that yep. your final, final, final answer? answer That's what I'm going to guess. I am being told from the control room, it is broccoli. Yay! Yeah. I'll tell you this, though. Mm. It's good. Quite good. Yeah, it's yeah, good. Okay. All right, let's move on to our second macamole. Okay. It's, it's, more it's tangy, a little more liquid, too. More liquidy, more tangy. The consistency tangy. is different. And, mm. and but it's what? I wonder if it's peas that have been blended with water. Like really dilute. Some I'll go with peas. I'll go with you peas think? too. Good call. Peas. Yes, peas. So this is the most commonly used ingredient in place of avocados per the control room. Squash. Squash. Okay. okay. Interesting. It's good. Again, healthy alternative. But I'd like to know. Yeah. I would like to know that there's squash I mean, in my macamole. To your point, also that not just food allergies. I think if you're on a very strict diet, let's say you're doing this new vegetarian keto diet, and you're counting carbs, you're counting proteins. I think it's important for you to know what you're actually eating. So, a little all right. Disturbing. Last but not least, let's I move mean, on to you know our. You're safe if they make it at the table. Yeah, that's then true. You can't, then right you can't. Then you can't fake it. This one is certainly peas. That I taste for sure. I can't taste it because I spit you it out. You just spit it out. I don't like it. No, and if, I think... if I got served this at, at a restaurant, 100%, I'm never going back. It's, it, it, okay, Drew, what do you think? No, I, it's my least favorite. I think it's peas. I think so too. Yeah, I, think... I think it's farts. It's a <laughs> <laughs> It is peas, guys. Room. I'm here in the room. It's peas. <laughs> hey. You know, this is why my nine-year-old son loves to watch you on this show. You, deep you down, like I'm a nine-year-old. Favorite, because you just said we had edible farts. <laughs> so. Yeah, yeah, that's what it tastes like. I think the takeaway here is buyer beware, of course. But having said that, if you were to make these at home and you knew the ingredients, yeah. hey, broccoli, squash, Fair peas. Super healthy. We're going to actually have these mock guac recipes on our website, thedoctorstv.com. Maybe what you could do at home is substitute one avocado with some squash. Mix, or mix with and some match. Yeah, yeah, mix and match. I feel like the squash was probably the closest in flavor and consistency. Yes. So that's interesting that that's the that's most I, common I like the broccoli sub. one the most, though. Really? Broccamole. Yeah. Broccamole! Broccoli.